guys, so I'll show you how to make this stick bomb in this video. Um, a, this stick bomb is just really easy to use. You just throw at throw throw at a hard surface like a wall, and it'll explode everywhere like this. Okay, so you want to make that? Let's get started. The materials you will need are obviously some popsicle sticks, and that's it. You might need a few, but you really only need four to make one of those stick bombs. So I'll just clear that off. So to make one stick bomb, you'll need four popsicle sticks. So to get started, take two aside. I'll just put them there. And then you'd want to arrange these sticks like this. Um, first do that. Then put another on top. Make sure that's on top of the bottom. I it's going to make an arrow pointing to your left. So then you would want to grab a third popsicle stick. Put it, I'll just move this. Put it just on top right there. So you make like a sideways four. After that, you want to grab your last popsicle stick. Hold these two corners. Make sure you hold them tight. And then you want to get this under here. Over this middle one. And then under this this corner, so you'd want to stretch it like this. And then if you do some tweaking and a little bit of adjusting, you should have yourselves a stick bomb like this. So I used a pillow, or you can use carpet because it's like it's spongy or something, or like it's squishy. So then you could like um, easily make it go under a popsicle stick and then back out. So that's why I used this pillow. So, um, yeah, that's how to make a stick bomb. I guess I'll make one more by myself. And if you can catch along, then, yeah. So this is another stick bomb that actually works. Depending on how tight you do it, you might have to throw it harder. There's multiple designs, but this is what I find the most simple. So I grab another four from this spin. So then you would make a sideways arrow pointing to the left. The top one is on top. Then make a sideways four. Hold these two corners. Put that down. And then under this corner. Uh, I might mess up sometimes though. I make weird noises a lot. Okay, so here's another stick bomb. So this is supposed to be called the boomerang, but when I make it, it doesn't really look like one. And this is actually really simple to um, make it a five star. Because this looks like an uncom incompleted star, you can just add one like this. Add a stick just like this to create that star. So if you want to do that, you want to make that behind, behind this. And then over this middle section, but behind that. But I'm not going to do that because it's hard. See, like, it's behind this one, but then it needs to be behind this side. Anyways, so that's how you make a stick bomb. I hope you enjoyed. But wait, let me make one more and actually try to prove that it's called a boomerang. Because I need to make it look like a boomerang. So to make it look like more like a boomerang, make it more wide. And then make sure this stick doesn't really stick out on that end. And then hold these two corners. And then here's a tip. See this distance right here? From here to there. Or from here to here. Let's see. Let's say from here to here. That stick. You'll see. So this is the distance, right? And then you want to try to do the same distance on this side. So let's see, this is like that, so then I need to do the same distance, which is right here. And then, you would put the popsicle stick in. That's what I find that's easier. Okay. So, that does not really look like a stick bomb again. Wait. Oh wait, never mind, it does not really look like a boomerang. See, like, now it looks like a boomerang, right? Because it's more triangle. If these ends don't stick out, then it looks like a boomerang. So that's why it's called boomerang. So if you have some practice, you can do it really well and just explodes everywhere. And you can make a whole arsenal. So, um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please thumbs, like, comment, subscribe. 
and I'll see you guys in another video. Peace.